everybody and welcome back to a brand new Hearts of Iron series on the channel. Kicking it off with the Cold War mod as many of you have suggested. You ask if you get it. Here we go. Oh, that Red Army song in the background. Aye, aye, aye. As you can tell, we're playing with the Soviet Union under Dmitry Yazov. Uh, what we're going to be doing here, we're going to be doing, going for something quite... Funky. You'll see as we go along, but we're playing as a communist Russia, Soviet Union. And uh, I don't know what my goal is here. I have no idea what my end goal is here. Maybe world dom domination. I don't know. But we'll find out as we go along. You guys in the comment section throw some goals at me. Throw some ambitious things at me. And we'll see where we go. But for now, let's get the show upon the road. Let's go. Right, so I'm going to put a strategy speed spies. Tech, let's go. Yeah, Cold War transports are needed. Decryption algorithm, encryption algorithm, boom, 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 get that all done. Right, mill factory's kicking off. Ha, <laughs> that needs to go. Right, support equipment, super, uh, la, 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 la. Give me tow darty, tow down our tank. Give me motorized, give me light mech, give me mech, give me light tank, give me MBTs, multi roll, attack, UCAV, bomber, transports. Bing, bang, bong. Right. Let's get all of this sorted. So I want everyone on a three stack. I'm pretty sure we'll be able to get away with a, a, a three on everything. There we go. Only a couple more. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Right, so we're going to get away with that. Naval dockyard. Give me convoys. I want a, a full line of five on that. I need to unite the uh, things after. Right, so the tree. The focus tree will probably give away what I'm going for. But you'll see. <laughs> you'll see. There, right, Indonesia. Yeah, give me some of that luscious rubber. Uh, CV factories, what are we doing here? Right, I need loads and loads and loads of civvies. Give me loads of it. I want as much civvy factories as possible here. We need to build an empire that can stand the test of time. And what better way to do that than just completely... Put everyone to work. I mean, we're a work, we're a, we're a worker state, no? So we might as well put the people to work. There we go. Get as much civvy factory as you can. Get to work. Beautiful. Right. Um, that's coming in a minute. Right. Let's get the units together. So we've got the whole of Europe under our realm. Okay. This is just to, just to be clear, this is like the second time I've actually ever played this mod. So if everything goes to hell. Don't blame me. It wasn't my fault. It was, uh, Dimitri's. Yes. Right. My 24 stack. I'll put you under Vladimir Sh 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 Shamanov. Yep, I said that correctly. Right. Line up against Finland. Wait, are Finland ours? Finland are not ours. Beautiful. Right. Get to it. Exercise. I want you to have a nice little attack goal such as this. Da, 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 dun, dun, da, da, dun, dun, dun. Right, line up all the aircraft in the area. I think that should be okay. Beautiful. Uh, now I need to rally up the rest of the other troops. So how much have I got here? 21. Beautiful. So I want 21, 22, uh, 23. Give me one of you. 24. Beautiful. Right. 24 of you. Okay, just getting an idea of where I stand. Give me Viktor Bondarev. Come here against Turkey. Superb. Right, line up against Ankara. Just get everyone moving, really. So that, that way I can sort of see what I'm doing and what I'm working with. Um, how am I doing here? Yep. Yeah. You guys line up. You guys line up. I'm going to need to build up an army. Like, there's not, it's very, very clear and obvious my army's lacking. That's fine. Something we can work with, though. Right, you guys come here. I think that's all. Yeah, that's all my troops. And you guys, I want you to line up against Afghanistan. For old time's sake. Super. Oh, wait, no. Afghanistan are an ally. Well, don't line up against them, then. That would be daft. That would be a stupid thing to do. Line up against Persia. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Line up like that. And then you guys, I'll hand you over to 
Uh, Pavel Popov. And then everyone just get exercising. Super. Right, so now I need to work on the whole navy thing. Uh, I need to, first of all, find a navy. That normally helps. Have I actually got a navy? I haven't got a navy. Well, that's good to know. At least we found something out today. Right, submarines. Max them out. Uh, destroyers. Max them out. Light cruiser. Max them out. Missile cruiser. Max it out. Carrier. Max out. So I want one of you. That's gonna... Oh, God. Okay. So that's gonna take it up to four a year. Fine. Give me ten. Give me twenty. Give me five. Give me three of these. Super. I think that's a relatively good starting, uh, starting amount. We'll send everyone to Leningrad. Superb. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get copyrighted or whatever. I'll have the video taken down for all this copyright music. But you know what? I don't care. This is, this is the music that comes with it. We're going to embrace it. Open arms. So everyone's sort of getting into their position. Faction map mode sort of looks like this. We've got the Warsaw Pact. Uh, we've got nothing else, but we've got the Democratic League and then the British Islands Protection Union. Yes. Well, it's not going to matter that much, but we'll, we'll, we'll see what we can do. Now, if you don't mind, take a sip of the tea. Beautiful. Right. Okay. So, first one gets done in 32 days. That gets done in around 50... 40, 60, 60 days. 60? Is my math really off? I think my math is off. God damn it. I've fallen apart at the seams. <laughs> right, Mongolians, People Republic. Oh, foreign Chinese Socialist Republic. I like that flag. Yo, forget that China. I like this China. Look at that flag. That's such a, that's, that's such a cool thing. Right, Yazov assassinated. Terror in the streets of Leningrad. As Chairman Yazov was attending a state tour of the recently opened European Liberation Museum. One of his supposedly loyal guards opened fire on the head of state, killing him almost instantly. As the rogue bodyguard was terminated by his colleagues, the other Politburo members rushed to Yazov's side, only to see the bloody mess that was, until that moment, the most powerful person in the world. As the news spread quickly across the Union and around the world, millions are now in shock, only to then wonder who will take charge of the strongest nation on the planet. We salute you, comrade. Yes, we do. So now it says the Politburo is now in charge. What happens? Election of the chairman. As the position of the most powerful person in the world is now open, the Politburo must select a new chairman. From the hardline faction, head of, uh, head, of, head of the KGB, Vladimir Putin, has gained support from those wishing to spread. Chapel of Tablet destroyed. Don't care. Don't care. This isn't about Putin. Shut up. There we go. Uh, spread communism around the world through violent means. Gennady Zyuganov, uh, Yazov's second in command, essentially groomed to become the late chairman's successor, wishes to continue his predecessor's legacy of peaceful, the peaceful strengthening uh, of the union. Alexander Ruskyov, uh, or Ruskyoy, has announced his candidacy for the top job, calling for extensive economic reforms but few political changes. However, after the death of the chairman, former Politburo member in exile, Mikhail Gorbachev, announced to the world that he would be pu he would push to be allowed back in the USSR. If this is permitted, he could put the union on a path to total politic and economic reform. So we can go Gorbachev, Rots, uh, Rus, Rut, 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 I can't pronounce it, Rutskoy, Zyuganov, or Putin. Well, I wonder who I'm going to pick. <laughs> Come on, it, it was obvious, it was office. Obvious, uh, it was office, obvious, there we go, Papa Putin. Papa Putin. We've got Papa Putin in charge. Good old Vladimir. Right, we've got the Navy building up very, very quickly here. Right, Alexander Vitko, get ready. Right, I want to put you in patrol in the Baltic. Get to it. I want to quickly adjust the Navy a tad. Everyone go to this flotilla. Superb. Beautiful. Beautiful. Right, okay, so that's going to be done. Just want to make sure that I've done that correctly. Yes. Right, so we're going to start working on our navy. The better. The, the, the quicker we can get a navy, the better. Um, I really need to spread my influence, don't I? Yeah. I'm just thinking how I'm going to do this. Okay. So, what we're going to do... Princess Diana dead. Oh, okay. Rip. Rip Princess die. 
Um, so what I'm thinking of doing is um, potentially... Hold on. I'm going to send a 60 to here. I'm going to put this on speed 4 whilst I faff around. You guys, I want you geared up and ready to absolutely hammer Finland. Uh, you guys here, I want you to come down to this region. Uh, 800 will do. Politburo debate done. Okay, right. Let's just focus here. So I actually want to come to here and just get cracking with this. Modern construction. Just get up to date. Putin has been done. Assassinate Gorbachev. Well, bye-bye, Gorby. <laughs> right. Get everyone all organized and ready to move. Princess Diana's funeral. Okay. I mean, it's sad, but it's not exactly an event that affects me. That sounds very narcissistic and dicky to say, but it is what it is. Right, everyone gear up. Asia Minor is now your air target. How are we doing with aircraft over in Asia? Need a little bit of work. The whole area needs a major overhaul. God, okay. We'll have to cross this bridge when we come to it. Right, okay, so what are Turkey rocking out of curiosity here? 94, yo! Turkey, what kind of steroids you got your troops on, man? Madness. Absolute madness. Right, so I can't exactly do anything whilst that's still that. And it doesn't help that I'm a 0 0.5 per day. That's anything but helpful. Right, nine days I can get both of these done. Uh, speed 5 it again just to get things back up to speed. Superb. Okay, so 5 and 5. I think for my first war it's going to be Finland. Second war Iran. Third war Iraq. Then Pakistan. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to have to do. I feel like that's going to be the wise decision. Uh, everyone just sort of just carry on working along this. Just keep getting cracking. Uh, Mustafa Abdul Jalil assassinated. Uh, who's this affecting? Who's this affecting? Uh, Libya. Okay. That's fine. As long as it doesn't affect any of my Warsaw Pact members or anyone else. I'm fine. I'm happy. Uh, what kind of juice is China rocking? 145. Wow. Okay. I guess my 68. Oh, wow. Soviet Union, not exactly the strongest power. Strongest nation in the world. I think that's rather overstating. <laughs> Ideo ideologically, maybe. But uh, practically, nah. Nah, 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 nah. We're not as powerful as we claim to be. Situation in America. Very messy in actual America. I'd like to see Texas do well. Good old Rick Perry. Revived. Texas. Okay, America. Donald Rumsfeld. Then we got Noam, Noam Chomsky. And Angela Davis in the Communist Party Union of UAPR. Yes. Not a very big force to be reckoned with, but still a force. I've got an idea, though. I doubt I can do it. But I want to take Alaska back. But then doing so will invite the whole league. In Canada, what are you rocking? Canada's packing fairly. Right, you know what? I want to get Marines. I want Marines. I'm going to need Marines for this. I'm going to assault the UAPR. Get a... Potentially get a bit of land in America and start progressing here. But at the same time, I'm going to need to guard the homeland. For all I know, China's going to kick up. Like, what's, what, what's China's focus tree like? Right, so you've got the generic tree, which is good. Arabic Islamic generals will sign. Okay, fair enough. What does that mean for the A AIS, though? Or the AIR? Alright, okay. So let's have a look. Encryption algorithm. <laughs> but it's better than YouTube's. <laughs> I'm sorry. I had to. I had to. Part of me said to me I had to. Uh, what's this? Far right, okay. Assassinate Gorbachev. The death of Gorbachev. Since his attempt, attempted arrest in the 1980s, Mikhail Gorbachev has remained in exile. For decades, since the Soviet government has tried to determine his location and either bring him back for trial or save the time and assassinate him. However, these attempts have become fruitless, with reports suggesting the KGB quit the operation years ago. Instead, there has been a completely unexpected turn of events in the city of Chicago. After receiving reports of gunshots, the local police discovered Gorbachev had just committed suicide through two shots in the back of his head. The aging former politician had been living in the city's city apartment for years now, unknown to Chicago authorities, and especially hidden from many Soviet spies. A truly unfortunate end, comrade, indeed. But uh, anyway, next, uh, next down the Putin tree, let's have a look. 
Uh, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? Uh, total KGB control. Yeah, why not? What's this going to do? Uh, so it's going to... Justify war god. Okay, 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 okay. Yep, yep. I like that. That looks good. Let's do that. <laughs> okay. So I'm looking around. And quite honestly, there's not much for me to do. Like, I ge I'm genuinely just sitting here trying to get something climactic to come along. But it's not looking like it's going to happen. Justify war goal, can I do that? Six more political power. Okay, well, something important is going to happen. We're finally going to take Finland. Right, liberals in bad year result. Okay, Liberal Union declared war on the National Salvation Government. Okay, so we've got a civil war going on. Interesting. So we've got Tripoli and Southern Tripoli. General Haftar revolts. Okay, now we've got the Three Army of Libya. Jesus Christ! You've got the liberals versus the authoritarians versus the army. I'm pretty sure I know who's going to win that one. The army have got... I, I, I'm sorry, but I'm going with the army on this one. Benghazi and Islamists. Okay, never mind. And we got the we got the Islamic State. we got the Islamic State of Libya. God damn. Right, I'm putting my money on the Islamic State or Free Army of Libya. And now we got the communists. Oh my god, it's a four-way. It's a five-way. What the hell is going on? Libya is in all cans. Of funky, st funky stuff right here. This is yowza. Yowza. <laughs> Alright, well, glad I'm not Libya. Bam, 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 bam. Savo, yep, yeah, give me Savo. 245 days is going to take quite a while. But it is fine. We have time to wait. What's your bonus? Commando out of supply. Ooh. Alright, Victor Bondarev. And you have Panzer Leader. Interesting. I should probably give you more armor divisions then. Alright, you guys are all focused. Sweet. I actually want to throw a few of you here. Uh, wait, hold on. Yeah, I want to throw a few of you to Northern Scandinavia as well, just to spread it out. The Christian Algorithm. Super. Big and strong. Here was I. See, I'm tempted to turn the music off. Guys, do you want me to turn the background music off? Like, let me know in the comment section again. I mean, I don't monetize these because, uh, you know, to be fair, I would make next to no money off of them anyway. Um, but <laughs> um, I don't monetize these. Uh, but obviously, copyright being copyright, there's a chance I can get a hit, I suppose, and have the video taken down. Uh, otherwise, 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 do you are you bothered about it being left on? Do you guys care? Does it make it a better experience for you? Let me know. Let me know in the comments. Okay, so... Looking around, there's not there's not an awful lot that I can do. I mean, 10 days time, we get the KGB control as Papa Putin. But that's it, really. That's it, really. I need more I need more national unity. Stagnating economy. I need to get rid of that. That's, that's really hurting. Um, I also need to change that to war economy or partially. Yeah, I'm going to need 450. Or 150 and then 150. I mean, it takes it down a lot, but... Still. Right, okay, end the reformists. Change popularity. Change. Game base national unity plus five. Yes, please. Oh, oh, wait, hold on. Consumer goods battery 5%. Okay. But output plus 20%. And construction speed plus 20%. Yes, please. Get building, people. Get building. Get to work. Soviet Russia is rising once again. Look at that. All along the Finnish border. I don't think they're going to stand a chance. What are we doing here? Okay. Is the trade still doing that? Nine more days for the encryption algorithm. That's fine. Get this done. Five. Four. Three. Oh, God. British Prime Minister assassinated. Oh, my God. Prime Minister David Owen and his deputy Shirley Williams were hunting on the outskirts of Greater London when their Secret Service became aware of a possible threat. According to officers, a suspicious sedan was parked at the fence line on the grounds with its owner gone for hours. With the service, in fact, more than 100 metres away from the pair, it became clear to them that the two most powerful politicians in Britain could be a target of an assassination. The dispatch proceeded to run towards Owen and Williams, but they were too late. A camouflage figure took two shots. One hit the Prime Minister, and the second barely missed Deputy PM Williams. Piercing the hill... Before anyone could come to their senses, the assassin had disappeared and Owen lay motionless at Shirley Williams' feet. Fair enough. Nice to see the British Secret Service gets paid for their time. Anyway, Shirley Williams. Hey. 
Okay, what have we got? Scottish tensions, bastion of Im uh, European democracy. Queen Elizabeth II. I wonder if you can actually put Lizzie in charge. I'd like to see Lizzie in charge. Right, do that. 20, 20 more days for that. Super. Uh, I want to put reinforcements as a maximum right now. Uh, that's still taking its time. Obviously, that's going to speed up with time as we eventually get more factories and such. Uh, but right now, I just want to I want to get that done. Uh, alas, I kind of want to go take Aleska back for the Russia. Uh, LA is the capital, of course. I kind of want to get these done before they start building up. I'm going to need a navy for that. Uh, is my navy limited? Just out of curiosity here. Let me check my navy. No, I could potentially take my great navy out there. But there's so many panels, so I'd need to... Obviously, I only can cover three at a time. So if I launch from here, I need one, two, three... One, two, three. So I only need two big navies, and I should be fine. Well, that's okay. I mean, I just need to build up two big navies, and then there's, you know, happy days. We'll do that then. Um, right, modern construction tools, happy days. Let's click research. Uh, modern industrial robots, factory output plus 20%. Yes, please. Let's get on that. Let's push down that as quick as possible. 22 days for protected networks. 22 days for decryption algorithm 3. Italy declares refugee crisis. Oh, no. Uh, what are we doing here? End trade regions. Uh, that's going to be another 25 days. Cool. Uh, Spetsnaz Brigade. What are you? Mechanized inventory. I really need um, Marines. Marines are a big... Big, big need right now. Queen's dis Queen dissolves Parliament. Yo. Queenie. Queenie, Queenie, Beanie. Hey, baby girl. What you be doing? Okay, so apparently I've got no Marines. Not going to lie. Kind of confused here. I don't have Marines. Okay, maybe it's just going to be the Spetsnaz Brigade then. Perhaps. Right, just let it run. No more days. Uh, I'll start producing some Spetsnaz then. Right, give me three of these. I'll spawn them all the way over in Siberia. Alright, um... Yeah, I'll spawn them here. This is perfect. Set them as a high priority. Beautiful. Okay. So yeah, Lizzie dissolved Parliament. Lizzie, 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 baby, what you be doing? Wait, what's this? Half-mast? Let her in? Threaten the Conservative... <gasps> you can bring Queenie in! Oh, you know we've got to play this modders. Oh my god, look at it. Just look at it. Yes, yes, I've decided. Next time I play this mod, I know who I'm playing as. <laughs> oh, dearie me, it's absolutely beautiful. Right, I'm going to start pushing down the infantry tree. I think it might be a smart idea to start doing so. A decryption algorithm 3, superb. Right, um, let's start going down the tank line, actually. PT90, let's get that done. Oh my god, this is fantastic. This is absolutely fantastic. This mod is incredible. This mod is genuinely incredible. Uh, I want you guys to go on actually hyper-aggressive and change that colour. Does it, like, guys, seriously, everyone in the comment section, let me know. Does this colour irritate you like it irritates me? Like, this turquoise is so frustrating. It just drives me bonkers. Let me know if you're the same. Uh, la, la, my name is Putin. Monitor work. Factory output plus 10%. Oh my god! Putin getting my pants. You are getting these workers into labour. Jesus! Embrace that labour force, Putin. You're doing some, some magical things to me, Papa Putin. Magical, magical things to me. I can't explain. I also can't explain how I need one tank thing. You know what? I don't need one tank thing. I need a reconnaissance. No, I don't need a reconnaissance. What do I need? Motorized... Just give me one. Give me one. Just Leningrad. I need to add it to this. That's an odd number. Don't like odd numbers. They have to be either maxed out completely or not at all. Uh, you guys are sort of coming along. Yeah. I've got my Spetsnaz Brigade. Get them geared up in the south. Right, who's your leader going to be? It's going to be Igor. Wow, that's a freaking name. Right, time to butcher another name. Igor Jujenjewich Konashukau. Yes. Be Igor for short. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, it's that horrible turquoise again. Go purple. Right. Okay. You get ready. I'm going to have to wait for these guys to pump out. Uh, we're losing manpower as well. I'm going to have to change that soon enough as well. Occupied territories. Latvia's flag's pretty cool. Lithuania being the Royal Lithuania. Russia being Russia. Prussia I can release. Oh, I can release Prussia. 
Oh, now that is tempting. I can release pressure. Oh, I... Oh. 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 I've got an idea. Maybe. Maybe. Oh. I, I think that we might see a pressure in this gameplay, guys. In this series, there's going to be a gameplay. Or there's going to be... What? 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 I can't talk. In this series, there is going to be a pressure. You are going to see some quality pressure gameplay. All right. There we go. Hook up with him. Right, let's upgrade. Do I want to do that, though? Improved artillery. Right, just start upgrading the arms for a bit. We're not going to war with anyone right... Like, anyone major as we speak. Um, so I think what we're going to do, we're going to have to bulk up. But to do so, we're also going to need to boost our equipment, really. All right, that can go. I just need that 10 to go. Right, you guys come down here. Super, I just need one more. Come on, this is so close. There we go. Beautiful. Get in line. Right, I want you guys to get done up to a good stage, good level. Superb, superb. Finland's right around the corner. Uh, when do we actually go to war with Finland? That's a good shout. Uh, let's have a look. 18th of February. Okay, so two more months. That's not too bad. Uh, change this to early mobilization. We should make everything else cheaper. Yep, partial mobilization is now 150 and war economy is now 300. Superb. Right. It means we're going to have to wait a while, but it's going to be worth it. It's all going to be worth it in the end. Superb. Right. Okay, so I'm going to force out the second line fairly soon. I just want to make sure everything's at a solid 20%. And then we can think about doing it. I just want my Spetsnaz Brigade done. It needs to be done. I need my Marines to get ready. Like, if I can, I want to hit America early on. Because if I remember correctly, the only real threats in the Americas is Canada, the APC, and the AR. Everyone else is pretty much a pushover. Apart from the UAPR, which sort of bulked up later on. Uh, rapid military expansion, which grows division training time, minus 10. Military factory control. Ooh. Recruitable population, plus 0 0.5. Factory output, minus 5. Ooh. Okay. Um... Okay, I'm gonna go wrap it. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Get it done. So you guys still, whatever, whatever. What are you doing? How are you? What's your, uh, what's your force? Fifteen. Okay, fifteen. No navy, no air force. That's that's something, I suppose. Right. Let's eat you. All right. Can I force that out? I can force all of you out at one time. That's beautiful. Beautiful. You guys all gear up under your own. Get rid of that horrible color. Go for a dark blue. Give you Dmitry Bul Bulgakov. Uh, I'm going to send you guys to here. Super. And then last but not least, we'll send a bunch from there, from Khabarovsk. Uh, and I'm going to need to start thinking about expanding into the realms of more manpower because I doubt the 385 is going to cut it. Um, also, down tank line, I can do for the Sprut SD. Uh, superb. Let's go down to the light tank. Embrace the PT-90. It's kind of pointless because we're already going to upgrade straight after. But is what it is. Is what it is. Superb. Um, support for democracy grows. Okay. Something to do with America. Something to do with America. Uh, what are we doing here? Salute the sailors. Meet with the communists. Oh, you're meeting with me, are you? You're meeting with me? I did not... Right. Begin investigation. Question the president. Okay, so you can sort of take him down a very interesting path. This is interesting. United American Commonwealth. Now, that sounds interesting. American Peace Act. Uh, I think I might have to play America. They've got a very interesting... Fire the New York government. Threaten the old guard. Bernie speech. Good old Bernie. Uh, push for greater freedoms. Meet with the communists. I'm not sure what that's going to do for them. Sanders in the committee. Sanders at the podium. Unite all Americans. Oh, God. I need to get my, I need to seek my teeth in before they, they unite America again. Oh, God, no. That's the last thing we need. No, 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 no. No. No, thank you. Me no likey. Me no want that. I'm definitely against that. Uh, I'm going to leave you guys for a little bit more. I need to wait for you all to get to 20%. Uh, next month, we actually go to war with Finland. Uh, looking at it, it's going to be 18th. Yeah, so fairly early on. Halfway through the month. Near enough. Um... Everyone's all good to go. I think the war with them will be done in no time. Change you to a uh, search and destroy sort of thing. 
It's no good. Convoy raiding. Convoy raiding. That's better. Hit them in the, hit them where it hurts in the supplies. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Halfway through. Halfway through. Come on, another. There we go. There we go. There we go. It's nearly time. It's nearly time for the first. Really, artillery. You, you, you go and ruin the moment. Right, give me some more tech. There we go. Right, into war. Oh, sorry. Improved artillery upgrade. Get that done. Anyway, where were we? Yes. War. The first war of the Let's Play. Let's get it done. Revolution. You can have revolution. It's just come knocking. <laughs> there we go. Send in the troops. Get to work. Look at that. Just absolutely hammer them. Demolish. Break their lines. And all of that fun stuff. So, um... Finland's game over. So, moving on to next target, Iran. I wonder how much Iran's working with. Iran's working with 51. God damn. I did not expect Iran to be rocking that. Interesting. Um, I kind of want to start working on that as well. Um, yeah, I kind of want to start working on different things. I don't think here can boost my manpower numbers. New. No. Okay. Right. Okay. Right. It's fine. Uh, go with uh, end of reformists. Let's go with that. Boost uh, national unity and all of that. So it's fine. So Finland's nearly done. Um, I think this is where I'm going to end the episode, guys. So thank you very much for watching. I'm going to continue next time once we finish this. Uh, it'll probably be, you will never see a Finland uh, when the new series or new episode starts. Uh, I hope you like the idea of the series. Um, I hope you're as excited for this one as you were for the last. And uh, yeah, thanks very much for watching. If you have enjoyed, don't forget to, of course, click that like button and or subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next episode we do. Have a good one, guys. I've been Anglo, you've been you, and laters.